Good morning. Happy New Year. It is January 1st, 2018, approximately 9 o'clock in the morning. And it is way too cold outside. It's 8, 8 degrees right now. 8 degrees. I should be snuggled up in my bed underneath my covers. The problem is I need clean sheets. The problem is my sons need clean clothes for the week. I need clean clothes for the week. So I don't have the luxury of sleeping this morning. But it's 2018. So I finished laundry. Um, I need to clean that area up. That looks horrible. Finished my laundry. Um, Gabriel's with his mom. Gabriel went with his mom. That was pretty dope of her to take him. Uh, yeah, he's been looking like he loves spending time with his mother. Nathaniel's over here eating breakfast, sort of. Uh, and today I am just working on lesson plans for the week. So today's gonna be a pretty boring day. Not much I'm doing. It is what it is. Sometimes days are boring, and you're entitled to some boring days. Today's gonna be one of those boring days. Especially since it's like 10 degrees outside in New York City. I'm not going anywhere. Nowhere. Your boy is staying right here. Right? What's, what's that on the side of your head? You tried to twist that? Mm. It just happens? Mm. Yeah. He's eating breakfast. I will show you the rest of the house. It's a mess. I have boxes. You know what? That box is right there that needs to go out today. There's uh, my son. He looks like he has a headache. Mm -hmm. You need a hug? Were you drinking last night? Yep, yeah, I was drinking at church. Drinking at what church is this? What church is? Yeah, drinking at absolutely. church. Absolutely. I was dancing and drinking. Dancing and drinking at church. While watching children. While watching children. What kind of church? Is that? Yeah. But nothing big is going to happen today other than me doing some schoolwork. That's all. 2017 is over. 2018 is here. Just another day. Another year. Yeah. Yeah. What's going on? Today is January 1st, 2018. I didn't do much today. However, my kids didn't do much either. Went to church. Gabriel spent the night with his mom. They're back now. And the garbage needs to be taken out. You think they would take it out without me saying anything? Nope. The garbage piled up very high. The recycling needs to go out. And if I don't tell them to do it, they won't do it. Even if I give them chores, because I give them chores. They got chores to do. But do they do it without prompt? Nope. And then when I ask them to do it, they get upset. Now here's the thing. Well, they don't want to get upset. They get a little annoyed. They could be on the cell phones that I pay for. Nice, expensive, premium cell phone that I pay for. The internet that I pay for. Computer electronics that I pay for. Netflix, TVs in their rooms. They could be laying down, doing absolutely nothing, playing with any kind of device that I pay for. In a nice heated apartment that I pay for. I pay for the heat. The electricity that's being um, used to power the TVs and electronics, I pay for. But if I ask them to take five minutes to take out the garbage, it's a huge inconvenience. That's the reality about being a parent. You can give the kids the world, but the second you ask them to do one thing, like take out the garbage, do the dishes, clean your room, it's a huge inconvenience. See, but me, I'm the type of dad that I'll start cutting things off. I'll change the password to the internet, 
I'll make sure that the only people you can call, me and your mother. I'll make sure that you can't use the internet on the phone. I'm taking away video games. I'm taking all, I'll shut it down. Not to be a mean dad though, but to teach him a lesson. And show them appreciation. As a parent, I don't ask for a lot. I don't. You know, they take out the garbage twice a week. Twice a week. I help out with that. They don't have to do dishes. If they were to just wash their own dish out, they'd be straight. Straight. <sighs> Kids, yo. Kids, like, I got, if I'm, I'm just too embarrassed to even show this to you. All this over here, I can't even show it to you. I told them they have until 8.30. It's now 8.12 to get this garbage outside of my apartment and out to the front curb so that they can come pick it up tomorrow. So we'll see. If it's not done at 8.30, everything's getting shut down. Shut down. You don't look like you want to be working. He has a tube. I know he has a little pad. I'm going to put the stuff here. The stuff right there. The stuff like that. I'm going to have an attitude, son. I'm going to have an attitude. How do you like your Nintendo Switch? What did you do? 